What's up, YouTube? This is Rose Go back again with another video, and I check it out. Where my saints at? Now, a little update on Jay the Youngin. May he rest in peace. So, word on these YouTube streets is, people, Jay the Youngin mind is, minding his own damn business sitting on the front porch. All right? Some people come from the back of the yard. You know what I'm saying? From the back of the yard. And from my understanding, there's a street right there. So, like, your house right here and literally behind your yard is a street. All right? So, they didn't park right there. They jumped out, came around from the back of the house to the side of the house and did what they did to Jay the Youngin. Now, may he rest in peace. Now, see, people are saying he was on house arrest and whatnot. Okay, I get that. What My thing is, was this the house that they had set that up with that he was going to be here at that particular house where he's going to have to do his house arrest stuff you see what I'm saying because if that's not the case maybe this would not have happened you see what I'm saying and I could be wrong but if that's where he was supposed to be at or whatever have you damn you know what I mean um, some people say he was visiting see when these type of stories come out it be so many different stories don't nobody know shit until It'd be like at the very end of the story. So, I'm still getting confused stories about this shit. So, all in all, my thing about this, people, how I feel about this, is you, you can't go back to your hood. All right? It's safe to say get the hell out of there. Because, see, this is the backwards part we play, people. You do all this to get out the hood. But then you go back. God damn. What was that? Look. Rappers, okay, okay, let's get it out there. People are not gonna stop being rappers, put it like that. No, they ain't. They don't care about their damn soul, no way. They don't care. So, at least be smart about this shit. You get famous, you get big, get everybody you love about the damn hood. Get them out that area. And they even can't come back. Because that's gonna start some shit if somebody do something to them. Stop. Get their ass up out of there. And if they tell you, I ain't moving, okay, well, I'm not responsible for your ass. I got shit going on. You know what I'm saying? They don't care about your ass either. You see what I'm saying? Now, if they don't scare the Jesus out their ass and they be like, okay, I'm, I'm going. I'm where you want me to go. You know what I'm saying? Well, then that's on their ass. Because you didn't told them. You know how I got this money? You know how I really got this money? See, that's another, that's another damn problem, too, with this dirty money. Rap money is dirty money. Let me tell you. See, back in the day, some parents had morals. And they knew their child was out there doing something wrong. And then they come home with all this damn money. And they talking about her mama, here, here goes some money for the light bill. And she said, uh-uh, I don't want your dirty money. Huh? Some parents used to be like that and probably still like that today, but it's probably only 1%. They say, I don't want that dirty money. That's dirty money. That's the devil money. I don't want that shit. I'd rather work hard, you know, 9 to 5, before I take your damn dirty money. Let's just get to this. That shit used to go on. But see, people didn't got too damn comfortable with they, with they, with they children out here doing Lord knows what to get this damn money. And then when they all they want... They coming home, they ain't even got to say, here goes some money. They asking for the money. How much you make today? Can I get some? Of this dirty money. You see? Of this dirty money. And this rap money, that is dirty money. That's the devil's money, man. And it's too many of us that's fallen victim to what? This devil's money. The Devil's Pie. Bring D'Angelo back. Devil's Pie. Shout out to D'Angelo when he made Devil's Pie. Go back and listen to that damn song. Off Belly. The movie Belly. It's the Devil's Money. And everybody know that shit, but everybody want what? A piece of that Devil's Pie. It ain't that motherfucking serious. Now, I got a good saying, and you know what the saying is? Don't let the past catch up with your ass and this is exactly what happened another example of the past catching up with somebody's ass and it just happened to be 
Mr. J. the Youngin. May he rest in peace. Now he's left back children. Huh? He's left he's left back children. Dolph left back children. Nipsey left back children. All these rappers that 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 have died have left back children. FBG Cash, FBG Duck, King Vine, you know what I'm saying? Shit don't make no damn sense. The more these type of stories come out, man, people should realize, man, stop, stop following. You still following shit. It's going to end your ass in a grave or, 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 or your ass in jail. In some type of Rico case or some stupid ass shit. Or life, doing life because your ass didn't murk somebody out here. And it wasn't for the cause. It's for your male ego. It's for your damn male ego out here killing people like that. You know, tit for tat. The shit ain't gonna never end as much as I want it to end, as, as much as it should end, as much as they should cancel the fuck out of rap. But they not gonna do that. And these damn record labels should be ashamed of themselves for bringing, letting them people bring that type of music out. They are the blame. Yeah, the, the artist is the blame too for thinking that shit cool to say. But them damn record labels and shit, whoever gotta gotta uh, get that shit a, a pass or okay to get out there to the radio waves, they ass should be ashamed of their damn self. These young people coming to you, 17, 18 and shit like that, talking about murder, 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 red rum. I got murder on my mind. I got murder on my mind. That type shit. You got little bitty kids singing this shit. Five, six, seven, eight. Transitioning they mind real early to get out here and murk somebody. Rappers ain't even rappers no more. They gangsters. They murderers. They killers. You know. And they some drug heads. I remember at one time, only jazz people, you only heard of jazz people getting a little tooted and booted. <laughs> but they played the most beautiful music. Played the most beautiful music. These damn rappers, they play evil music, and they get tooted and booted. And they play evil ass shit, because that's, that's they that's they damn essence, people. That's they damn soul. Music. People fail to realize that music is a beautiful thing. It always has been. But when you got evil tendencies and when your soul ain't right, guess what? That's what's going to come out. Some devil ass shit. Some evil ass shit. And that shows what type of soul you have up in your body. Jay the Youngin. Sitting on the damn porch, man. People come from behind the house to the side and get him up out of here. Send him straight to the what? Upper room. Damn. When you got enemies like that, huh? <laughs> when you got enemies like that where you can't sit on your damn porch, you can't sit on a porch and get some fresh ass air, man, you you need to be isolated from, from, from people you love. Huh? They could have shot up everybody. They could have went inside the house. Shot up everybody, man. They could have. But they, they wanted that one particular person. And, and, and they did what they did. And this is the thing. When you're on house arrest and shit like that, you can't have no weapons around you. You can't have none on you. You can't have none around you. So why the hell would I sit my ass out there on a porch like everything. Ain't nobody gonna do shit to me while I'm on this porch. Or while I'm walking to the store. That's when the shit happened. These young people need some help. Alright? I don't know how they gonna get it and, and, and when they gonna wake up. But it's looking like Cause you gotta understand, once like this happen, it's gonna be more retaliation. That is just what it is. Cause they ass is all messed up inside, people. All messed up inside. 
Shout out to Jay the Youngin family, his children, man. Out of all things, man, his damn children, man. You hear me? Because they innocent. They don't know what the hell going on and what for and why. Now they got to grow up with this bullshit. We got to get it together, people. Message.